years together and we almost did it. We almost made it to common law. <laughs> but you just couldn't let that happen. For that I thank you. Seeing you standing here looking as beautiful and happy as ever is something I'm glad I didn't miss out on. Over the past years I've watched you grow into an amazing woman and mother, leaping into everything you do with your entire heart, wanting to make a better life for everyone around you. While you are focused on everyone else around you, I promise to be focused on you. To support you in every adventure you want to take, and also every adventure you don't. To pick you up on a bad day when things just won't go your way. To continue to wake up way happier than you, just to get you going in the morning even if you tell me to go away. I promise to always love you and strive to be a man you can always love back without a second thought. Most importantly, I promise to be your home. Someone you can come to about anything, no matter how you feel, and not worry about being judged or scared. Someone who will always encourage and lift you up, and someone you can always come to for comfort. To your father, who couldn't be here, but who is always with you, I vow to give your daughter a life worth living while also keeping her safe. I vow to live up to the standard of a father you have given her and that I hear so much about. Between her, her mother, and sister, it'll be a tall order to fill, but I promise to be someone that you would proudly welcome into your family. I love you, Alyssa, forever and always. I want to 
start off by saying I love you. You are everything more to me. I never thought the shy guy at the party would be the guy that I spend the rest of my life with. You and I both know that I can be indecisive at times. I simply don't like making decisions. But there is one decision in my life I know that is the right one. It's to spend the rest of my life with you. I can list off all the things that I love about you, but to put it simply, I love everything about you. And yes, even when you tell me no, or when you stare at me waiting for me to ask you if, you're, if it's okay that you play your games at the end of the night, which, of course, needs me to go ahead. <laughs> Being with you has brought me a sense of joy and comfort in knowing that I will always have someone on my team to not only support me in every way, but to love me unconditionally. I knew from the moment we started talking that I was going to fall for you, and I did. And from that moment, you was on my calm and constant, and of course, I've been your chaos, lucky you. <laughs> I promise to always make you laugh, by not being able to form sentences right, or by saying things that make absolutely no sense. Like that time I was talking about Nyla's back arms. Remember that? <laughs> I promise to make sure our children have my attitude just to keep you on your toes. I promise to never fuss about you playing your video games unless it's two in the morning and you wake me up when you're coming to bed. I promise to always be by your side and support you in every way possible. Trust me when I say I notice and appreciate all the things you do for me, like getting me a fountain pot, even though you know I'm going to complain it tastes funny. I am so grateful to have found you, and I know in my heart that you are the perfect person for me. Nolan, I respect you wholeheartedly and love you with every fiber of my being. Even though you made me wait six years, I want you to know that it's been the best six years, and I can't wait to share the rest of our lives together. At the beginning and end of each day, I'll choose you, and I'll always choose you. Thank you for being the person that you are. I love you the most. Ladies and gentlemen, it's my honor to present the newly married couple, Mr. and Mrs. Nolan and Melissa Hill. Woo!